Okay. This is a 10 cent. No limit hold'em. Multi. Again, I did want to play an Omaha one, but it's nowhere near full, so. I won't, because it's nowhere near full, even though I wanted to play one. I haven't tried an Omaha sit and go. I might do better. Since at this level, like the bottom of the the bottom of the well, that's a good place. But just under the well, it's probably better to have four cards than two, considering the ship they play with. I'll be able to catch hands quicker, and they'll call me with. One pair, maybe. I was watching YouTube, a hand with Gus Hansen and some other people in Omaha. That's why I want to play Omaha. He and Gus lost to two pocket pairs that were in the hand, and he had a straight and a flush draw. Not a straight draw, he had the mage straight and he had a flush draw. And the other one had queens, two queens and two kings in their hand on the board was straightening with two spades. Mage straight and a flush draw, ace high flush draw. And that one hit queen and there was a free on there and a free. So he had three queens and two frees for a house. <sighs> and that's why I want to play Omaha. I suppose I could try a one dollar one, even though I don't like them, but I could try one. I might do, depends how long I'm in this one. I also need to pour my water. I'll do that now. Okay. In the time it took me to do that, it's still not my turn. And I thought this was a turbo. Another thing I noticed was I call too much. I think I would have folded even if that one didn't raise because I call too much. Although I like doing that. I do that in cash games, I just call a lot. I either hit the cards or I don't. And sometimes I bet, even if I don't hit. But I do call too much. I think the best place to be is here and here. Those are the two best positions. Because you get to act first, or you get to act last. That's why they're the best. Plus the small blind's good because you've already got half in. I'll toss it.
I suppose I'll sit here and try and figure out what they have. Seeing as he checked, he was looking at it and then he thought check. This guy checks, so I guess he has nothing. This guy, I think he has nothing and he, he also checks, so he probably definitely has nothing. This guy puts a little hundred bet. He does a call. So I'm guessing he has a diamond and a pair. If I was to put a guess on him, a diamond and a pair of sixes. And him with his little hundred bet. Well, him with his raise, I'd guess a set of eights. Nah, nah. Wouldn't have a set of eights. Did he auto check? <laughs> I think he auto checked. He either had the flush or a straight. Or he had neither. Might have had a set of eights, but I don't think he would have checked a set of eights with four diamonds. Actually, there weren't four. Who knows? This is worse than the last one. Do I want to play with it? He's going to raise, so it doesn't really matter. Oh, he didn't. Um... Okay, I'll play one. The blinds are going up, so... He's gonna raise, isn't he? I've wasted my 30 chips. Down the drain they went. Watch them go down the drain. Or maybe he's just getting a pizza out of the oven. Ah, I don't like that. I can do two things. I can check and watch them again, or I can put a bet. A five would check. I think I'll do that. I'll check and see what they do. That's a safe card for me. He puts a stupid little bet in. Putting that stupid little bet in, he could have a ten. That guy with the call, he could have a five. This will hide my hand too, I might as well just put that in. Well, it will hide my flush draw. I can't really fold. If he has got a five, I can still hit a queen. And my flush might be good, so I can't really fold it. Judging by the re-raise, he either has... A 5 and he played it slow and then stupidly put a little bet in or he hit a 10 let's see what you do another clubs come why would he check it I'm beat if he has a house would he check a house why would he check Oh, you think I have a flush? It won't fold me, will it? I'll put a little bet in and see what you do. I guess I had him beat. Well, that's obvious, but I thought it was, a I thought it was strange the way he checked it. I'm guessing he had a five. Well, if he had a five, why would he check on the end? Oh, well, I'd know if he had a house, he would have pushed all in. Then again, who knows? He could have had a. F either, if he pushes all in, I'm probably losing. He's either got a better flush than me. Uh, he had something like. I don't know if he had a better flush than me. But 
But I say I say he'd had a five, judging by the way he played it. These two rags. Which rag has the better kicker? Oh, I thought you both checked. Oh well, he always looks nice when I see the first card, the second one puts me off. Not this time.